The Circus Academy is a modern circus school for people of all ages and all levels of ability. We get people from all walks of life here. There's a lot of people from the community who have never been upside down until they've been here. We walk around to about six to eight schools in the neighborhood and pick up kids after school and bring them here for classes. What I enjoy most about working here is definitely watching the self-esteem grow in the kids. We have March break and summer camp and kids will come who've never done circus and perhaps aren't the most physical of kids, but there's so much variety in circus that there's always something that they're going to be good at and they're going to gravitate towards. So at the end of the week when we have the parent show and they're standing there under the spotlight and like doing like a big ta-da and they're just so proud of themselves. Parents are crying and it just it makes me feel really good that we're able to to foster that and to and you know and I'm super lucky that I get to watch that. We had the space and we wanted to to kind of use it as a, as a window into the circus for the community and a place for people to gather and hang out and just kind of a social space. It made sense because of the events that we have here to, to have a cafe and, and a place for parents to hang out while they're uh, waiting for their kids' classes. And uh, we came up with a name and thought it was really smart. So, you know, <laughs> had to open after that. <laughs> uh, the Lunacy Cabaret is probably one of Canada's longest running cabarets now. It's produced by Zero Gravity Circus, and it's a way for performers to try new material or to do material that's a bit underground or adult that they couldn't do at corporate events. Expect to be shocked by something, likely. Um, there's clowning and vaudeville. There might be magic. Uh, there'll be circus acts, burlesque, comedy. The, the audience dresses up in costumes. It's everybody's just here to have a great time and there'll be, you know, stuff that you love, stuff that you might not necessarily understand. Um, it's 18 plus, so don't bring your kids, but it's definitely fun. We spent a lot of time scouring Toronto looking for a suitable building. And at the time, the film industry was um, kind of taken over all of the, the buildings with high enough ceilings. We really wanted to be in a neighborhood as opposed to in an industrial space. A lot of gymnastics and sporting facilities are kind of out away from the people and we wanted to be right in with the people. So when we stumbled upon this place, it was just perfect. When we first moved in, this neighborhood uh, was a little sketchy. It wasn't um, as, as open as it is now. You didn't see as many people and um, there was definitely more criminal activity going on in this neighborhood when we first came. Now the neighborhood is, is much more of a neighborhood. There's people out on, on the streets a lot walking around. You see a lot of kids. There's a lot more uh, new businesses have moved into the neighborhood and you know it's like a super safe and positive place to be now. For the Circus Academy, definitely will be more locations. Um, seeing our first like little tiny kid grow up into being a professional performer would be pretty exciting. We have kids that came in definitely from our very first class when we were a class of eight kids once a week who are now teenagers and they're performing with the Canadian National Youth Circus. And so when they get a little bit older, they can start to uh, perform professionally.